What's going on team? I'm glad you made it back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you five of my favorite exercises for achieving and maintaining one of the hardest calisthenic skills there is in the game, the Hephaesto. The first exercise is going to be a supinated false grip back lever. This exercise is super important because it's going to help you build insane strength for your wrist, your elbows, and the bottom lockout portion of the Hephaesto. The bottom of the Hephaesto is one of the most dangerous parts of the Hephaesto, so the stronger you're able to get it, the more bulletproof your foundation is going to be. Negative Hephaestos will train you throughout the whole range of the exercise. At first, your eccentric descent, which is going to be your negative, may be quick, but the stronger you get, the more control you're going to have over the movement and the slower it's going to get. The slower you can go, the better you know you have all the control to gain that skill. Make sure to use a false grip. It's very easy to slide and not have the false grip, but the stronger you get, the better your false grip will be for the movement. Half reps from the top help me start to understand the feeling of pulling myself up from behind the back and not just falling down. Once you start to get this feeling, you're going in the right direction and you know the vessel is not too far from you. Tying that in with all the other exercises we have for this video and you're going to be getting the Hephaesto in no time. Supinated back lever pull ups help you build that concentric strength from the bottom of the movement. So not only are you allowing yourself to gain strength from the last exercise at the top with your pull, but now once you are able to put them both together with the bottom and the top, you're going to be able to get that Hephaesto pretty soon. And last but not least are weighted bicep curls. You can always vary it up, but I like using dumbbells in order to work on any muscular imbalances. This exercise is super important because it will be one of the only exercises you will ever be able to do that will help you scale the resistance, allowing you to go super heavy to help you build strength or you're going much lighter to condition your body. Start with the tuck variations for all of these exercises until you feel comfortable expanding your body lever. Eventually, after doing all of these exercises in conjunction, you will build the strength to hit your first Hephaesto or continue to build your strength with the movement if you already have it. These are some of the exercises that help me to get it to where it is today and by continuing to do these, I'm looking for a lot more progress in the future. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to hit a thumbs up, hit that notification bell so you can be notified for more videos coming in the future. And make sure to share to a friend or share with somebody who you know wants to get this move or share with somebody who you know has never even seen this move. Make sure to squeeze, breathe, and believe through all of these exercises listed above. Definitely going to want to make sure that you're breathing throughout all of these exercises. It's very easy when doing these strength movements to hold your breath, but allow yourself to focus on your breath and really believe in that breath so it can help you get through all the movements. And of course, squeeze those muscles and believe in yourself and you'll get this in no time. I can't wait to see you in the next one.